Hey guys, my name is Bob. Welcome to the Excel Math Channel. Today we're going to solve one of the differentiation problems, which is to differentiate y is equal to one over sine inverse x. Uh, basically, the first thing that I need to take note for this uh, particular kind of uh, question is that you cannot bring this up, all right? So, which means to say that sine inverse x is not equals to sine x, all right? Uh, it's not equals to sine x to the power of negative one, all right? This is different, all right? This basically is just um, two different things. All right, so you got to be a bit careful, okay, when when you actually solve these kind of problems. All right, so, um, so basically, what you do uh, for this uh, question itself, first thing that you do is to uh, multiply both sides by sine inverse x. So I have y sine inverse x equals to one, and then I will differentiate both sides with respect to x. So we have uh, differentiate with respect to x. So y sine inverse one x. Um, is equals to the differentiation of uh, the constant one and uh, on the left hand side itself we'll basically do product rule so we have to identify two terms uh, so in this case we'll let y be the first term and we'll let the sine inverse x be the second term all right so we we differentiate the first term so that will be dy over dx because uh, this is implicit differentiation so you've got to take note and keep the second term so that will be sine inverse x plus uh, we keep the first term and then differentiate the second term so we know that the differentiation of sine inverse x is equals to 1 over the square root of uh, 1 minus x squared all right and uh, on the left hand side it's just zero okay so which means that we bring this over okay the next thing that we do is bring this uh, term over to the right hand side of the equation so what do we have down here we have a dy over dx um, psi inverse x uh, is equals to the negative of y the whole thing bracket 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared okay cool okay uh, last but not least we divide both sides by sine inverse so that uh, our left hand side will only appears um, dy over dx so we have dy over dx it's uh, equals to negative y bracket 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared okay times 1 over okay sine inverse x okay so now we know that y is equal to 1 over sine inverse x you can just basically uh, sub into the equation itself we have negative 1 over sine inverse x times 1 over sine inverse x because i'm like uh, rearranging this times 1 over the um, square root of uh, 1 minus x squared okay so and last but not least the last part we're going to do is that we will we will basically multiply this together because they are the same so it's just basically 1 minus 1 over the sine inverse x square all right um, the whole thing bracket 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared and that is it that is the answer to this uh, particular question uh, why the differentiation of y is equals to 1 over sine inverse x all right that's about it um, Thank you guys for watching, do subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.